What's up guys, it's your boy Ryan here from 24-7 Exotics. I missed each and every one of you guys and I owe you a huge explanation. But before I get into the boring stuff guys, we're back. We're going to Cars and Coffee this morning here in Edmonton, Alberta at the South Common Hawaii restaurant. I have a few laptops today that we're gonna be giving away. You do not wanna miss it, stick around. This car is so insane, you guys. So, for those who remember, 24-7 Exotics started off with a Lamborghini Gallardo as my first supercar. It does look like it's gonna be a write-off, unfortunately. And the only reason I originally had the McLaren was because it had everything my other car didn't have. Leave me a comment down below, let me know what you think. McLaren 650S, uh, the only car for the channel right now, is that the car that you guys want to see ripping around or should we trade this in and get something else? For now, we're in the McLaren 650S, you guys. And I mean, the car is stunning. There's a lot of good features to this car. If I could ever figure out that damn launch control, um, maybe I'll have some fun in this car. I mean, the roof comes off. That's always fun. is so much faster than the Lamborghini Gallardo. I mean, I tuned mine, I had mine pushing 610 horsepower from the original 552 to the wheels. You guys, I don't know, there's something to be said about this. There's something to be said about the 650 McLaren and the speed that comes off the rear wheels of this car, it's insane. And the way the turbo spools up and kicks in, I don't know, unless I'm just not used to it, this car absolutely would destroy the Lamborghini Gallardo. So that's one good thing. And oh man, is it a lot of fun. All right, here we are guys, South Common in Edmonton, Alberta. Cars and coffee, we got great coffee, we got great cars as you can see in behind me. Now we're gonna go take a look as the Lambos just showed up. We got a bunch of Mercies that just showed up here. And you know I love myself a Lamborghini. We're gonna head our way over there. The Lamborghini Murcielago, you guys, my absolute dream car. Have a look at those seats. They sit just cockeyed, making long distance road trips a little annoying, but other than that, this car is an absolute beast. So Peter, we're sitting here looking at these Mercies. What were you about to say to the owner? Oh, there's an RS6 just down over there, and I think we spanked both of these things. The RS6 is absolutely insane, and the front on this thing literally looks like a dozer. This thing would wipe you guys off the highway. Let me know, would you guys take an RS6 Audi wagon with all the horsepower you need in a car for the street as well as practical? Peter, you could take uh, all your golf clubs, you could take a family, dogs. I can take my dogs, yep. Um, or would you go back over there to a Mercy? I don't know, I think the Mercy is just a little too big to be practical. I, I drive a BRZ. It's a tiny little thing. Probably the smallest car here. Yeah, but it was just getting looks. Yeah, it's been getting looks all day. It's the only one here. There's multiples of everything else. <laughs> there's three RS6s, two Mercies, four M4s. Hey, there's only one McLaren 650. That's, that's very true. That's very true. But let's look at this for a second. We have a Lamborghini Gallardo first gen. The differences are, compared to mine, we got a longer headlight. Mine had the LP560 bumper, which this one doesn't have. However, he's got the carbon side skirts on this one. 
as well as a custom exit exhaust. <laughs> no, this is all custom exit. Wow. What did he do here? If it's me, honestly, I'm taking this car. Yeah. Yeah, there's, there's something for me about the Gallardo. It's small enough, it's practical enough, it's still very quick, it handles like a dream. I just, this would be the car, because I would want a daily, right? Right. Like, yeah, I'm, you're not gonna daily a Mercy. The issue with the Mercy is that the maintenance on them is just too much money. Yeah. They're not affordable to keep on the road, to drive as a daily driver, to go and put a million bucks into it or something. So, yeah. as far as the Lamborghini brand goes, the Gallardo put them on the map, let's be honest, in the GT circuit, as well. It's a beautiful car. And even the first gen with the lines and all the, the detailing compared to the, the O9. Yeah. I did like the lights and the, the other, you know, small aesthetic design changes on yours, but I would take this all day. Right, and he did some a little custom grill on here. There's This isn't exactly a stock rear end, so i curious to find out who the owner of this is. Did you do the work yourself or did you buy it as is? No, I did everything. It nice. came basically when I bought it was bone stock. Still a work in progress, so okay. don't laugh at the uh, the straight pipes when I show you that, okay? Okay. Uh, nice. I added a backup camera, which really helps because you can't see can't shit see backing up. Yeah. It's a game. Yeah, converted it to rear wheel, added the side skirts. I did convert it to rear wheel. I wanted to yeah. do it to mine. It's fun. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, I bet. Yeah, you turn the traction control off and it's... There we go. The back end gets out. Yeah. So, but these aren't uh, OE, are they? Manual. Have you seen this yes. one on LP? Yeah. 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 No, 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 no. Hell not yeah. on LP. This is first gen and that's the way it was. Hey, right. Yeah. Uh, the manual. Is it? Oh, oh manual. there's the money. Oh, manual. Let's, let's, oh, and it's two wheel drive. <laughs> let's get the money shot. Hell yeah. That's right. Oh my goodness, I just rode off a 2009 Gallardo in September, oh, yeah. <laughs> LP564, Yeah. Uh, so I'm in love with your car, my friend. Yeah, not much done here, and I haven't had a chance to clean the engine bay up yet. Wait, but hold on, you said not to laugh at the street, but what's wrong? I mean, look at them. I don't know, it's not terrible. It's not terrible, but they. I got, I'm working on a valve system right now, hopefully it'll be done in the next couple weeks. But it's, it's definitely loud with like the straight pipes, like with the oh, test I heard pipes. you pulling in, it sounded yeah. good, yeah. You just gotta get titanium to continue up in the gear. Yeah. yeah. Oh, I'm, I'm going on the, the, on the mid pipes already, right? Yeah. 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 Set. yeah. That's it. A couple of weeks it'll look a little bit more finished. <laughs> no, I think it looks great. Ryan, Ryan, do you approve? I do. Yeah. Ryan approves. So oh, thanks. Appreciate that. Yeah. I mean, that's the car I'd be taking. Yeah. So Peter, I don't have everything here. Yeah. You, Peter's over. Would take a guard over the Mercy all day long. Would he? Yeah. Oh yeah. 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 Well, they're fine. Like they're they're so much smaller and nimble in my opinion. Yeah. I uh, don't have the V12. It put Lambo on the map in the GT circuit. Like no, it really shit did, yeah. crushed everything. So. Yeah. They were the best selling, except for now the Hurricane, right? But yeah. Exactly. Would you do the rear wheel drive on yours? The conversion would be super yeah, fun. Yeah, it'd be yeah. fun. Yeah. Two hours to do. It's yeah. the easiest thing. Yeah. Really? Yeah. Yeah, I, I, I didn't keep my car long enough to do it, but I wanted to do it. Well, I'm going to finish off with you, my friend. Thank yeah. you so much. It was good talking to you guys. Absolutely awesome. Appreciate I miss it. mine. It makes me miss <laughs> mine even more. They're such a fun car to drive. Uh, yeah, I love it. Until about two days ago, I actually hated my 650. Yeah? Um, Why's that? It's just not my Gardo. I enjoyed my Gardo. The I don't Gardo's, know how to explain like it. Like it's raw. Yeah, yeah, yeah. exactly. The break your neck uh, shift changes. Yeah. Um, oh yeah. So yeah. No, nice car, my friend. And I don't mean to just skip over this Ferrari, but I'm not really into it. You're not? No. What don't you like about it? I actually like I feel like you have to car. be uh, quite successful and got your shit together to have this car. And I just don't have any of that. I don't know, what do you guys think? Do you like these GTRs? Yes. Are you asking me, Ryan, or your audience? My audience. <laughs> What do you think of them? I love GTRs. Um, I, I mean, they're a supercar, but they don't look supercar. That's why I've never owned one. Yeah. Fair. But they are supercar status. Would this be the gen that you would go with? Or yes. do you like the older ones? No, I like the R35. Yeah. 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 
All right, Peter, how did you feel about the first cars and coffee of the season? Great, not a cloud in the sky. At nine in the morning, it was warm enough not to wear a jacket. That's nice. It was an awesome turnout, lots of awesome cars. What's your favorite car here? Honestly, that right there. First Gen Gallardo. Manual, rear wheel drive. Rear wheel drive conversion on that Lamborghini Gallardo, you guys. Hey, Sean. Hello. Guys, here we are with Sean. He's the uh, host of this event. Today we are doing our first Carson Coffee. Nice. RDF Pods Carson Coffee. This is basically leading to the big show. Uh, and hey, what's the big show? The big show is uh, we have three uh, shows. One in uh, Calgary, one in uh, Edmonton, one in Regina. Uh, Calgary, June 26th. Uh, Edmonton July 10th, Regina July 24th. So we will have about 200 plus cars. VIP experience, we'll have carpeted parking. Um, you gotta you gotta check out our event right for that. There's lots of information, so. Excellent, uh, and where can these guys find you? Uh, RDF cause, so RDF cause, so pretty much that, right? On all so, social also, platforms. All social platforms, awesome. yeah. All right guys, so Cars and Coffee is almost over. As you can see behind me here, quite the turnout. We ended up with this Huracan here, 800 horsepower to the wheels. This thing is supercharged, unreal car. And you guys know I miss my Lambo. Unbelievable. Right now, we're gonna get out of here from Cars and Coffee. We're gonna go do some giveaways. You're not gonna wanna miss it. Make sure you follow us along.